What's going on guys? Welcome back to Diablo 3 Season 10. Today we're trying out this uh, Fields of Misery thing. Uh, so yeah, the idea I think is to just like attack uh, groups of enemies and just keep running. I believe as long as you are doing damage to enemies. Like, I'm pretty sure that's the idea. Just keep hitting enemies so it refreshes. And I imagine this gets easier the farther you get. Um, yeah, so we're gonna probably lose this here. I mean, you want to chain together, like, at least a hundred, I would imagine. I feel like we're not getting very lucky on... Yeah, we're not getting very lucky on spawns here. Um, definitely want to hit up this cursed chest. You know, um, like I feel like this this could be okay. But I mean, you know, I've only gotten what two levels so far. Uh, you know, maybe I have to look into it a little more. But I'm pretty sure the idea is you are supposed to, this is what you're supposed to do. I mean, obviously try it for yourself. Um, could just be a bad density in this um, world here, so it's always a possibility. You know how Diablo is. Never quite what you expect. My land is I don't know if you guys can hear that. Um, my alarm clock just went off. I mean, I, I dropped it earlier. It's just static, but uh, kind of annoying. So. I will be right back and got to turn that off. All right, I'll shut off. Uh, yeah, must have switched on when I knocked it off the counter earlier, but it's all right. Uh, a little surprising to just be sitting here. Uh, what is currently midnight? It just turned midnight, so it uh, is just Saturday, April first, and that turned on. So it was a little, <laughs> a little weird, uh, especially because no one else is home. But what are you gonna do, right? It's, so you're just supposed to like group enemies up, but I'm just not finding. 
the the density that I would like. I'm pretty sure this is the place that uh, you know everyone's recommending is the fields of misery. Now I feel like I'm gonna go to another place after this. Um, we should, yeah, we we'll have more than enough time to hit it up, but. And again, this could just be a uh, bad, you know, bad seed. Uh, so there's not really a lot of enemies. I mean, we got a few massacre bonuses. Would have been better to chain them all together, uh, but I feel like the the festering wood has a good chance of being um, pretty solid as well. Okay, we gotta kill this guy. I mean, like, there's an even like we just have to kill this guy. Why, this is exactly why you have to kill these guys, I mean. At this point, I don't even care if any of them get away. To be completely honest, I got a legendary. I mean, you can't ask for too much more than that. Uh, also, um, we're at 72. So this is, this is what I'm saying, like, the Festering Wood, in my opinion, is a much better place for this. I feel like we can get to 100 here uh, uh, much easier. Possibly even higher than that. I mean, you can see the enemies that we have here. Obviously, you want to kill as many enemies as you can, but you also want to try to leave some enemies. Ah, we just missed that, but 122, so you can see that was pretty good, um, but apparently this is supposed to level you from 1 to 70 uh, in 4 hours. Uh, whether it works or not, uh, I'm still a little skeptical, uh, but I can see how it would. Um, Obviously, you're just doing a lot more, you know, you're just gaining uh, triple the experience you normally would. Also, I figure it would probably be a little better um, on a slightly harder difficulty. Uh, at least hard would probably be uh, pretty good, uh, if not even a little higher up. And when you get more skills, of course, it's always going to make things better. Um, but yeah, I feel like that kind of stuff would definitely help a lot. Uh, definitely not going to focus too much on this. Uh, this strategy here. But I definitely suggest giving it a shot. Maybe you'll have better luck than uh, you know I'm having, or maybe uh, I'm having you know decent luck and it's just. You just gotta stick with it. I mean, I can definitely see where, with the right numbers, um, you know, and the right mob density, it could be a really good way to level. But uh, for me, it's just not um, practical. Kind of boring. Uh, I like to mix things up a little bit. So, with that being said, actually, uh, I don't really have any other reason to be here. So. Let's go finish the bounties for Act 1. I mean, it shouldn't take too much longer, really. We already killed the Skeleton King last time, so... We got a cursed chest here.
These guys really gotta walk to me, you know? If they don't, it's kind of... It just doesn't happen. I feel like I didn't get any fucking time for that wave. Eh, whatever. We definitely want to see this because this could just be a huge, yeah, absolutely. Uh, it's just a huge buff for us. Um, we're definitely, as much as I you know, don't necessarily want to use it, uh, we're probably going to switch to Grasp of the Dead, uh, at least for a little while. Um, I mean, maybe not, though. Fire Bats is... You know, I say that, but I can always just put Grasp of the Dead on uh, another another thing, so it's not that big of a deal. Let me put Grasp of the Dead on 2 or something for now. Actually, let's do that. Uh, 2... We want... Um, we definitely gotta add that. Okay, so 2, we want Grasp of the Dead, and we're gonna grab this. Corpses fall from the sky, dealing damage, so we definitely want that. Um, and then... Uh, we just want to clear all this stuff. And zombie dogs, we want rabid dogs. This is all damage. Yeah, let's, uh, let's... No, I can't because I'm in combat, but... We want to open this and instantly cast Grasp of the Dead because sometimes it's enemies, which it just happens to be enemies this time. So you just want to do that every time. Um, open this up and cast Grasp of the Dead immediately. Okay, we're fine this time. I mean, this obviously uh, improves our damage a lot. This dagger, ceremonial knife, so... You know, my big thing is, uh, if you have a good damage, it doesn't really matter what you do in this game. It's not really going to take you that much longer to do um, anything, really. You know, you might you might think like, oh well, uh, you know, if you get these massacre bonuses and this stuff, blah blah blah. Yeah, well, sure, but uh, you need like, I mean, let's face it, you really need the cane set. Um, you need a ruby in your helm, preferably a Leoric crown. Uh, a lot of stuff has to go right for you. But probably better to level an alt that way. Uh, also, if you're leveling an uh, uh, alt character that way, then um, you're going to have all the gear you want, you're going to have the cane set, you're going to have all the bonus XP you can ever dream of, and uh, it'll actually work quite well for you. Getting pretty lucky here uh, as far as these eggs go, I never, you know, I mean, I never get that lucky, so... And of course, fire bats is just doing its thing. We're gonna try something a little different here.
I mean, that worked out all right. Also, there's no more bonus act. Uh, I don't know if I mentioned that yet. Uh, so that means you can do any act you want in any order, and uh, when I finish this, you'll, I'll show you on the map and stuff uh, that it, it doesn't matter. Okay, so uh, with that done, we will head back to town, we will talk to Tyrael, and we'll get our uh, our one box, and no more bonus, you know, just one. There it is there, a uh, large heroic chest now. So you don't get a, a bonus thing, you just get this. Uh, and this has everything that they both would have. So as you can see, uh, three runes, obviously we're playing on normal, so we don't have a lot of stuff. Uh, funny that I said I needed the cane set for that because there's the cane set. So I might actually look into this now. Uh, we might try it again next time uh, only because um, with the cane set this could actually work. So uh, anyways guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, next time, uh, depending, if I can, depending on if I can make the cane set or not, will depend on uh, if we go through this or not. So, hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. Thanks for watching.